Hey guys, uh, welcome to One Minute CM again. So we have a little angel here, and uh, um. he is the little chap uh, who is a communication uh, expert. He is uh, blogging yeah. about communication and uh, effective communication, and she started a uh, couple of weeks back during the pandemic. Very exciting uh, communication tip she is giving, and yes. uh, these tips are so cute that you cannot dare to forget. Uh, what she is mentioning. So, and the, the topics which she covers are very bold, very mature uh, things that uh, you know. Even adults take a long time, and mature people who have like worked in the organization for a long time would uh, you know take long time to understand it. And she is doing these topics in a very subtle and very nice and cute way. So we have Jia Agarwal here, and uh, thank Hello. you. Hello. Thank you. So uh, you you are the most cutest and the first young blogger we have on the show. So thanks. Oh, Gia. really? <laughs> Actually, thanks to you. I'm really honored to be here in this show. I've seen the people you invite, and um, I didn't think you would invite me. <laughs> <laughs> That's really yes. cute. Uh, so, Jia, can can you tell about yourself? You kaise shuru hua? How did uh, you start this? Okay. Yes. Uh, I'm Jia. I'm ten years old. I live here in Pune. Mm, this actually all it started because of my love of books. I love books a lot. So mm -hmm. I read anything I find, labels or any thing, any packet I find. I read anything that I see. So once I found a, a book lying lying there in, on my bed, so um, I thought to read it. So I started. I started. I um, picked it up and I started reading. Then I found it was really interesting, and I thought it would help my mother in her in her business in her work. So then I went to her and I started telling her about all sorts of things in the book that uh, uh, about business communication. So my mother said that you you speak so nicely. How about you make videos mm -hmm. so you can share your knowledge with everyone. So yes, so then I thought then that I could make videos, and then I started. That's how. That's really nice. So when did mm -hmm. you start? How many weeks it's been? Um, it's been a, a few, two, three weeks since I started. Maybe yes, two, okay. three weeks. And what what is your favorite topic which you're covering uh, in these uh, videos? What what is the message you're passing on? Uh, actually, um, the message is that communication is really really important. I mean, I mean, everywhere you go, you will have to communicate. You can't stay without communicating in any place. Even if it's even if it's in another country where nobody speaks your language, you'll still communicate with signals or actions. So anywhere you will have to communicate. That is the main thing. So that's why I did this. Sure. So uh, just for the new friends who've not been to Jia's uh, profile, Jia Agarwal's page yet, uh, let me go ahead and play a quick video on how hey she everyone. communicates. Hey everyone, my name is Jia. I'm back with a new video. Today's topic is talking on the telephone. Talking on the telephone. Huh. Now there are a lot of things now, to remember while talking, to talking on the telephone. And there are some advantages and disadvantages too. So I will be giving you five so tips on talking on the telephone. I will be telling you the advantages and the disadvantages. Now the advantages. Now it's the cost effective. Cost Why is it cost effective? Why is you're not, it cost effective? You're not traveling you're to not, that person. You're not traveling to that person. To a place to meet that person. To a place the to person meet is that not person. coming the to your place. Is not coming to it's, your place. Um, it's it's, um, it's cost effective. That it is cost, cost effective. effective. That it is cost because effective. Because you, you ask, you the, ask uh, that, the, uh, person that person a question, question. And, and the person replies immediately. So that is one of the advantages of talking on the telephone. Uh, no. Uh, no. Disadvantages. disadvantages. Yes, there yes, are disadvantages. disadvantages. There is a very There's big, a very one, big one, one. Have you spotted have it? You spotted it? Uh, I, suppose uh, you I suppose you have. Um, um, 
you can't see you the can't person's see the facial person's expression. Or your bo- or or bo- or mm. her body, body language. So you so can't you actually can't see actually what the person what is person actually, actually thinking. You can't see what the person is Okay, so friends, that, that's the way uh, she communicates. It's, it's very cute, very inspiring. So matured that, you know, as if she has already been a manager, she has been communicating for a long time. Uh, she is visualizing that she is a manager or she's a leader in a business. And that, that's the way uh, she communicates. So good, Jia. Or could, I mean, do you want to mention anything about this particular video? Uh, how it started and all uh, that. This this video, it's uh, I think it's about talking on the telephone. I guess yes, it's right. the, the talking on the telephone. You know, I had I had to get it a few tries to get it right that time, uh, because uh, so sometimes I missed a point or sometimes I stumbled, so I had to um, take a lot of tries to get that video right. Uh, and it happened with many of my videos, in fact, many. It's not just uh, this one. Many videos I had to ta- retake, retake, retake again and again, so that I could get the video right. <laughs> but in the first video, I was surprised to see that mm-hmm. it was really good. The first thing, I was a bit nervous that time, and uh, to my surprise, it was per- it was almost perfect. The the first video. Um, when I saw it, so I couldn't believe it. Did you get inspired? You know, this is the question from one of our uh, uh, audience, uh, Priya Murthy. She's oh. asking this question. From who did you get inspired? Now, um, actually, me myself. Because I always knew that I could talk really fearlessly in front of crowds. Mm-hmm. I always knew that. So when my mother suggested that I could make videos, I actually willingly agreed because I knew it would be fun and it would be um, a nice experience for me too. So that's the thing. Me, myself. Cool. So. They put one of the pictures on, you know, there is a, okay. a picture where you're meditating. This is where you're sitting on a table. Oh my. Oh, this one. This is, I think, the smallest version of you. Yes. So, yeah, can you talk about this particular picture? Uh, this, this, I, I quite don't even remember this picture being taken, but uh, uh, I do remember that uh, I was sitting there. And all the other ladies were um, doing meditation and I sat on the table because I had no way to sit. I sat on the table and started <laughs> It was really funny. Good. Looks we like some people were even watching. Yeah, we have oh, this problem. is me, cycling. Yes. Okay, cycle. This favorite cycle of yours and why is the color so matching with your dress? Actually, the my dress is matching with the cycle. Okay. Um, on purpose, my mother dressed me in those clothes, and it's perfect match with my cycle. <laughs> okay. Because my cycle was also blue and white, so. <laughs> it's nice. So, are you ready for the rapid fire questions? We want to know you well. And okay. Yes. 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 Okay. Yeah. What's your least favorite food? Uh, spinach. No, no, not spinach. Coriander. Sorry. Coriander. Hania. I don't like it. I hate it. Okay. So what did you? I love? kind of hate all types of leaves. Oh. Unless they're grinded. Okay. So you don't want Unless to eat. I don't the taste, but they look very uh, achieved, kind of. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, really so I don't like to eat them. Okay, so wait, wait, what did you hear last? What is the music you heard last? The music I heard last. Hmm. Um, it was this one. Um, I played Alone Part Two last night. 
that was the last music i listened to that's cute so can you make somebody laugh and what do you do to make somebody laugh um if i want to make somebody laugh okay uh, sometimes i tell them a joke or sometimes i do some funny actions sometimes i tell them a mistake i did a mm-hmm. very funny mistake <laughs> um something like that always if i want to make someone laugh okay uh do five emoji expressions or any expression uh through your face <laughs> five emoji expressions yes okay what is this hmm one <laughs> um two <laughs> <laughs> that's three <laughs> Okay. Yeah. And then one more is this one. Uh which one was that? Uh, let's see. Okay. <laughs> it's horn sticking out of the head. And the last one I uh, let me think. Um, um let's see. The fifth one just an out saying mm mm the last dream you remember jia the last dream i remember mm. actually i don't remember any of my dreams mostly but uh, mm, the last dream i remember uh I think cuz I am a quite Harry Potter fan I dreamed I was I was on a broomstick and I was playing Quidditch the wizard sport <laughs> the last dream I had was that <laughs> the last dream I remember cool your favorite thing in your room favorite thing in my room well not quite that's not quite in my room but I take it everywhere my kindle your kindle and my books that are the, those are the things i love most in my room yeah and we also saw your cute picture where you're hanging upside down while reading the book uh, oh, that, that yes i was uh, you know, i was i was reading i was i was reading it's a habit of mine i do different kind of poses on the bar and i read with one hand <laughs> what is the most expensive gift you want for your birthday next birthday most expensive gift i yeah. want a munchkin kitten i want a kitten kitten the cute one with big eyes which color uh brown and white brown and or white or maybe only white something like that it should include white okay so what do you do when you see that your dad is tired he's come back from work and then you know he needs some pep up so what do you do how do you make sure that he is like coming back to normal and you know he is happy um sometimes i ask him to play xbox with me mm-hmm. so he's lively more uh, sometimes do. he goes and sleeps and i tell him to sleep <laughs> okay. so yeah, get over it uh, sometimes he has to come from work and do more work hmm so i tell him to reduce the work a little and uh, do something else first sometimes he watches tv those are the lot of things that my father does after coming home so uh, i've also seen that you you boss around a lot so you boss around your mom and dad how do you do that uh, how do you do uh, that magic you know there are a lot of kids out there who are having tough time they don't know how to do it so what is that magic what? you do what do what you you boss around your mom and dad i've seen that earlier <laughs> i i i don't do it a lot but when i really really want something then i plead and i keep pestering them until i get it i want <laughs> it i want it i want it i want it everywhere they go i i, I will be i will be behind them i want it i want it i want it <laughs> so i always get stuff 
if I keep the string there. Okay. What's your favorite color? Favorite color? I like white and blue. Okay. Your favorite song? My favorite song. Okay. Um, Dark Side by Alan Walker. Okay. What's your favorite recent dance move that you really like? Dance move. Uh, I'm not quite into dance, but I like I like floss. Maybe floss. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Your favorite cartoon character? Um, I don't actually watch cartoons. I don't watch cartoons. Hmm. I am more into Netflix series and stuff. Oh my God! So, what what's your favorite character or? Cast in Netflix. Ah, um, I like this one. In Netflix, I watch this. So, um, I like Mildred. Mm -hmm. In okay. the worst witch, I watched one worst of that. Okay. I like Mildred most. What would you like to do when you grow up? Um, well, I'm thinking of becoming a detective, uh -huh. maybe a fashion designer, but who knows? I keep changing it. <laughs> That's a good one. Keep changing it here, you know, until, until yeah. you figure out, you know, keep Who knows? It. I may be into science that day, so I'll become a scientist. Who knows? Because I'm not much okay. settled in one place. I keep moving. I keep changing stuff. So there is a question from the audience. Uh, can you show us the floss move? <laughs> okay. So I have to stand up. Uh, I'm wearing headphones. Yeah, maybe you can just remove the headset, do the floss, and get it back. Oh, goodness. Or, okay. Yeah, okay. we can do it at the end of the show also. That is awesome. <laughs> okay, okay. Come out. <laughs> okay. Um, wait a minute. Yes. Uh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's nice. It's cute. So, yeah. Uh, okay. That was a good day. Yeah. Hmm. Um, Thank you. Thank you, Gia. So, yeah, next question. Who is it? I don't see any question. Yeah. This? Do you see it now? Yeah. Yeah. So, okay, next question. What, what's your favorite spread on your bread? Oh, um, I like chocolate. Okay. <laughs> Nutella? Uh, yes, Nutella also. Nutella also? Okay. Is what is the right time? Of chocolate. Good. Well, what's the right time uh, kids should get up during holidays? Uh, in my opinion, whenever they feel like it. <laughs> okay. Whenever they feel like it. Like if I feel of getting up at 10 o'clock, suppose, in the mm -hmm. morning. Then I would get up at 10 o'clock. If, uh, if I want to get up at 8 o'clock, I will get up at 8 o'clock. So, whenever they feel like it. <laughs> okay. What is the lie, the last lie you told your mom and dad? <laughs> if they're not aware. Actually, not aware. Um, the last lie I told... Okay, then. Mm. Uh, <laughs> okay. So, well, uh, let's see. The last line I told. The last line. I don't actually remember any last. Okay. Can, can you put your headset uh, mic closer to you? I think I think that's creating a bus stop. 
Uh, oh, sorry. Wait, wait. Yeah. Um, let me do this. We also have, in the meanwhile, uh, Rachna Agarwal. She is requesting if you can sing a song for us. What? Yeah. A song? Like, yeah. They know that we are, you know, sings very well. So. Yes. Yeah. So, but okay, okay then. Mm. I'll see. Let's see. Mm. Wait a minute. Yes. This isn't happening. Uh, yes, that's it. Now, can you hear me? Okay. Yes. Hmm. I have to sing a song for you. Hmm. A song. There are a lot of songs I know. Yeah, sing your favorite one. Let's Where see. you know the lyrics with confidence. Mm. Which song I know the best? I like this. I like Speechless. Go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> Here comes a wave meant to wash me away, a tide that has taken me under. Swallow and sand left with nothing to say, my voice drowned out in the thunder. But I won't cry, and I won't start to crumble. Whenever they try to shut me or cut me down, I won't be silenced. You can't keep me quiet. We'll tremble when you try it. All I know is I won't go speechless. Try to lock me in the I will just lay me down and die. I will take these broken wings and watch me burn across the sky. Hear the echo saying I won't be silenced. No, you wanna see me tremble when you try it. All I know is I won't go speechless. Wow. Super. <laughs> That's really good. Thank, thank you, uh, Rachna, because this song was not uh, in my questions. And you know, glad you asked because I, I could hear this angle of uh, Jia also. Thanks, Jia, for singing a cute song. Very cute. I mean, how, how do you manage that? Matlab, aapko, you see the lyrics or you, know, you understand it by uh, hearing the song itself. How did you practice this? Um, the if if I hear a song, the the first thing I do is um, I look up the lyrics for that song. I mean, I get uh, the the YouTube video with the lyrics and the mm -hmm. song in the background. So then I start seeing that. Mm. So then I start practicing that only. The good compliments coming in. From uh, Tirisha, oh. Mohit Agarwal, Santosh. So good. So next question. Okay. Yep. Are you a dad's girl or mom's girl? Oh, uh, sometimes dad, sometimes moms. Uh, you know? You know, there is only one of that. Whether or that uh, because because in the matter of uh, uh, TV and all that stuff, uh, I'm mostly a dad's girl. <laughs> and um, when I have to play with someone or uh, when I have to cook, then I am a mom's girl. So I can't decide, you know. <laughs> Yeah, so now this is a very tough one. So, you know, I, I have come to know that you are the most matured, uh, you know, a person in your house. So, how do you handle? Have... Yeah, how do you handle communication issues between mom and dad? 
I'm not quite mature enough. Uh, when I am when I am in videos, I am a lot mature. But uh, in really, uh, I am not very mature. I am a little bit childish, tiny bit. But how do you handle communication issues between mom and dad? दोनों जब झगड़ा करते हैं, उठ जाते हैं, तो how do you how does Jia communicate and you know how do you settle that issue? They usually don't have arguments a lot, and mm. when they do, they immediately solve it. So I don't have to intervene. And the... <laughs> solve that. That's really nice. So we have uh, Mr. Ram Kumar Agarwal. I'm assuming he is your grandfather. Yes. Yes. Yeah, he is asking Jia Dadi want to speak in Hindi. Oh, so I think my grandmother wants me to speak in Hindi. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Dadi wants to speak in Hindi. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Huh. Uh, okay. Hindi mein bataiye. Um, Hindi mein. Same question. Same question. You answer in Hindi. So whatever I asked earlier, so you answer it in uh, Hindi. Okay. So from the starting. Okay. Um. What is what was the first question you asked? So, आप mummy daddy के issues communication issues को कैसे solve करते हो? As a communication expert, आप कैसे solve करते हो? हाँ वो ज्यादा झगड़ा करते ही नहीं है तो अगर अगर करते भी है बहुत कम जब भी होता है तो भी वो खुद ही जल्दी से रिजोल्व कर लेते हैं हो गया हो गया <laughs> आपके इंटरव्यू में भी जरूरत नहीं होती मुझे कुछ नहीं मुझे कुछ बीच में बोलना ही नहीं पड़ता है हो जाता है ओके हु इज योर फेवरेट एक्टर एंड एक्ट्रेस इन बॉलीवुड अम हम्म एक्टर एंड एक्ट्रेस एक्चुअली मैं ज्यादा हिंदी मूवीज देखती नहीं हूं ओह माय गॉड ओके आई एम मोर ऑफ एन इंग्लिश पर्सन ठीक है सो डायरेक्टली लेट्स मूव ऑन टू हॉलीवुड अ यस ओके सो अम the most the most uh, favorite actor and actress i like mm. yeah uh, hollywood in hollywood sorry. yes english movies yeah any you know in... let's see mm. or you can you know remember the name of the movie you can mention that if you don't remember the actor actress yes yes <laughs> i like one movie which one was that Harry Potter. Okay. The most I like uh, Rupert Grint, Ra- uh, Daniel Radcliffe, and Hermione Granger. I'm, I'm a, I mean, I'm a total copy of her. Okay. I can even speak in her accent. <laughs> you know. So yeah, ek, ek, can you try one accent, one okay. sentence? So this is a very this is a very uh, famous one this is her most known dialogue hermione's in the in their first charms class so she's like this ron isn't able to do the spell so hermione says this <clears throat> no stop 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 you're going to take someone's eye out besides you're saying it wrong it's levy osa not levy osa Okay, <laughs> that was that was the Hermione. That's awesome. Yeah. Uh, so you you uh, listen to a lot of music. So you any favorite uh, artist? Artist. Yeah. I like Alan Walker the most. Okay. So if you get a chance to dance with somebody, so whom would you like to dance? One celebrity whom who you would like to dance with? Dance with. Uh. um dance with okay so actually in what what uh, what context are you saying dance with dance with any any context and any uh, celebrity who dances well and let's say you go for a party and all that you want to dance and you see one celebrity uh. Mm, that is a hard question to answer because I am 
Oh, I'm really small right now. Okay, so well, let, let's park this question for a couple of years. Yes. And yes. the next time, you know, I get a chance to interview you, I'm not sure whether you will give me. Yes, that, that will be good. That will be good. That time you can ask me about any celebrity and stuff. <laughs> then I'll be more familiar at, uh, okay. about all this. Describe your parents in uh, one word. We'll start with your dad and then your mom. So describe okay. your dad in one My word. My dad. Um, <laughs> uh, my dad. No, there are many qualities. Hmm. No, the brain no, qualities. Only one word. You have to you have to describe them in one word. Brainy. Hmm? Brainy. Brainy. Okay, that's your dad. Always he tries to uh, find new new solutions for stuff. Okay. And, um, and my mom is, let's see. Hmm. Motivational, you can say. Uh -huh. How is she motivational? Means, uh, she always motivates me, you can say. Always. Okay. Good. So, if you were given superpowers, which one would you offer? Ooh, superpowers. I would to know, give you like some of these okay. characters. So. There are a lot. Mm. I can't. Yeah, tell one superpower which you really want. You will take it first. Teleportation. Oh, good. Kahan jao ke usko leke? Anywhere. Means I can go anywhere in the world. <laughs> good. Oh. Yeah. So, what compliments do you receive most of the time? That I am smart. Mm -hmm. I sing well. Mm -hmm. Um. I play the piano well, and uh, you know I have a lot of talents. So, and I am a really book. I am a big bookworm. Good. So you, that's what you, most of you me. sing. You you do blogging. You play nice piano. Yes. Okay. Uh, and you also, you know, do really well with your rapid fire questions. So. <laughs> okay, yes, yeah, so then maybe. So what's the nickname you, you people call you at home? Your parents call you at home? Um, actually, uh, while my name is really small, not mo not much nickname, sometimes Jiu. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's the most common one. Okay. Most of the time. Good, good. So... Yeah. So thanks, Jia. You you answered the rapid fire questions very well. So thanks. I mean, very spontaneous, very natural. Oh, confidence, dekha hai aapke mm. <laughs> <laughs> So now coming to the uh, most important question. So when you become the chief minister, what what are the areas you would focus on? Yes. Now, if I become a chief minister for one minute, now let's see. I don't know what what much I could do in one minute, but I'll do my best. So the first thing I would change is the education system here. Mm -hmm. So by that I mean before I before I came here in India four years ago, uh, I was there in USA. So there, the the system was more innovative and project based. So it was not the uh, copy and write system there. Like mm -hmm. the teachers write on the board and you have to copy. It was not that. Um, the mo Most of the time it was project based. Assignments and all that stuff. And so if 
that is that curriculum and i mean that system and um, and he, india's discipline if they come together then it would just make a perfect school so that was that was that would be the the first thing i would do Super. i would do that yeah very nice thoughts uh, jia so yeah. <clears throat> you know what special today what today is the 40th episode of this particular show so you are a very special guest the 40th episode i didn't know that yeah so it's the 40th episode so any questions you have for me ah um, yeah so i'll give you a chance where you can ask me one question i can ask you one question yeah okay what is the most favorite thing you like to do in your free time i would love to spend time in my garden with my birds and uh, fishes okay so okay so you you are more of a nature person yes i saw some posts about uh, some birds and all that i didn't really like yeah. I, <laughs> i really like when i yeah. get admirations from you know mm-hmm. people like you <laughs> really nice so yeah you are so, more of a nature person yeah so nice. you know in in your uh, perspective jia this is i mean we are we are almost done with the show but uh, you you've seen the shows you've seen me uh, can can you describe about the show what's good about this particular show and you know something about me what what have you understood about me uh, you know in in this uh, few days of uh, interaction you would have gone through my page or yes, you know, yes i've seen a lot of stuff. yeah so your expert comments um the show and this okay so this show is a really good platform for you to display your uh, talents and your ideas it's a really good platform so it was great that i got a chance to come here really thank you <laughs> for uh, inviting me here and uh, about you let's see mm. sometimes a uh, see hmm. <laughs> if i wanted to describe then i would say that um you in in half your time you are a kind of a social person half mm-hmm. time you like to observe nature mm-hmm. stuff and uh, sometime you also like to spend with your families so um mm, all these all the stuff i think is about you mostly cool super this is this is a, almost like somebody has read astrology about me <laughs> okay <laughs> so we have another question from meena agarwal uh, she is asking you where would you like to go in your holidays oh holidays uh, you see i love beaches i love beaches Oh, same thing. I would yeah. love to go to a beach because I like to play in water. I I never miss a chance to go to a swimming pool. Mm-hmm. Um, and building sand castles, I just like it. Playing with sand and all, drawing stuff in the sand. Cool, cool, Jia. Uh, thanks a lot for joining in. Uh, really awesome. Uh, what, what's your next? project and you know uh, to, you know talk about your next project and you know all the viewers uh, request them to join your page uh, so feel free to do that before we end the show um actually about my next project um i think i'm just going to first uh, continue this series of uh, um, my videos of effective business communication uh that the first thing i would do is i would i would finish this series till the very extent um 
after that i think uh, there are many opportunities to be taken so there will be a lot to do after i finish uh, uh, this age this series there will be a lot to do after i finish this so who knows when i might do what <laughs> i don't actually think a lot about but by the way your page has more likes than my subscribers my paid subscribers so congratulations what? you have you know almost 500 followers who are you know following your uh, you know yeah uh, but i don't i don't actually regularly see that thing uh, really yeah big, big people generally don't do that so <laughs> they, don't, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> they don't worry about how many subscribers they have so yeah please please do ask uh, the audience to you know like your page so that they can yes, also yes, please see please like and follow my page ji like agarwal <laughs> good awesome confidence ji thanks for joining in uh, wish um, you all the best whatever you're doing you know thank you, thank you. with your cuteness your confidence your communication you know the way you're thinking so spread positivity and uh, thank you, you know, thank we, are, we are definitely the little cracker or you know chota pataka we have uh, yes yes i saw that post you know <laughs> so all the best do well and uh, thank you all uh, do follow jia agarwal's post uh, it is jia agarwal you can search on facebook um, she is doing lovely cute posts her uh, in this particular platform uh, apart from her confidence i want other kids also to do uh, their best there are a lot of kids out there who are still thinking they have awesome talent but they're still thinking that okay should they go online or not when should they start they're just waiting for the first start so jia is a good example she's just 10 years old uh, she's done awesome job so yeah spread the word out and you know let the kids also uh, do their best uh, in you know the areas of interest they like so thank you all for joining in have a great evening thank you jia god bless Take care. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.